Hello friends. In this video we're going to talk about the most useless things we've bought. Such as the glued banana, Elizabeth's cake too, and another. Queen Elizabeth II wedding cake yes, you read that right. In the year 2013, a piece of British Queen Elizabeth II wedding cake was sold at auction for £560 sterling. Considering that 66 years had passed since the wedding at the time, that piece of cake is hardly good for digestion. And the price for it seems robbery. But the sacrifices that can be made for Her Majesty's sake. Britney Spears used pregnancy test allegedly, this test was found by a cleaning lady in a hotel room in Los Angeles where Britney was staying. Although there is no direct evidence that the test actually belonged to the singer, it was put up on eBay and online casino. Bought it for $5,001. A sacred sandwich in the year 2004, an unusual item appeared on eBay. It was a slice of fried bread and cheese that, according to its owner Diane Dazer, bore the image of the Virgin Mary. Dazer kept the sandwich for more than 10 years, during which time it did not deteriorate at least in appearance and even helped the woman win $70,000 at a local casino. However, need forced her to part with the sacred sandwich. More than a hundred thousand bets were placed on the lot, eventually bought it for $28,000. Justin Bieber's hair in the year 2011, Justin appeared on America's hit show Ellen DeGeneres and offered her a lock of his hair on the condition that she would auction it off and give the money to charity. The teen idol's small bundle of hair was sold for an absurd $40,668. Any amount given to charity is commendable. But given that the winning bidder almost certainly had no intention of donating their hard-earned cash, it's likely that Bieber's hair was the target. Cain with a ghost of a grandfather as a bonus children are always afraid of something. Some are afraid of spiders, some are afraid of the dark, some are afraid of everything. A six-year-old boy in the year 2004 began to convince his mother that he was haunted by the ghost of his recently deceased grandfather. He believed the ghost was attached to his old cane, which he still hadn't thrown away. To allay the children's fears, the boy's mother sold the cane along with the ghost on eBay. The price of the lot was $64,000. The buyer of the cane was the online casino Goldampolis. Come, which collects and collects rare and bizarre items. Diamond dentures a Hollywood smile is no surprise anymore. A denture made of 156 diamonds and gold of the highest caliber is still possible. Such a luxurious object, made in one of Dubai clinics, is estimated at $153,000. You can't chew with it, and that's not its purpose. A banana glued to the wall these days, any object can fall into the category of contemporary art. So it's no surprise that an ordinary banana, held to the wall with a strip of duct tape, was sold at auction for an incredible $120,000. And this is not some special fruit with jewels hidden inside, it was bought in an ordinary supermarket.
The author of this masterpiece is an Italian artist Maurizio Catalan, who specializes in the installation genre and is famous for his provocative creativity. I wonder if the banana installation has lost its value after being handed over to its new owner. In the year 2017 Christie's auctioned off the personal effects of actress Audrey Hepburn for over $5 million. Among these items was the screenplay for Breakfast at Tiffany's, which sold for $700,000. Given that anyone could download a copy of the script from the web, the buyer essentially paid for the skin grease Hepburn left on the pages. It's like buying high-end water from the bathtub the streamer bathed in. A copy of Super Mario 64 in many ways, this game defined the path of three-dimensional platformers, and to this day still regularly appears in lists of best games of all time. But Super Mario 64 is no longer young, it's over 25 years old, and available as re-releases and ports. This calls into question the need to buy a sealed Mario cartridge for $1,560,000, even if the box was in perfect condition. Prior to bidding on heritage auctions, the lot was valued at a modest $100,000. Undoubtedly for a video game collector, this item is one of the holiest grails imaginable. However, all he got for $1,500,000 was a plastic cartridge, a cardboard box, and a quick start guide. Framed window This is both the most expensive window in the world and probably the most worthless thing sold for a fantastic sum. All credit for this window goes to Lee Harvey Oswald, the assassin of American President John. Kennedy, who was once behind it. A collector from the Netherlands bought the item on eBay for $3 million.